Hey guys, let's do some red shirt doodling today. Today we are going to draw two of my spring characters, Ted the bear and Venus the Venus flytrap. First, we're going to draw Ted the teddy bear. So on the top of your page, make a little circle. I am using my whiteboard easels, but make sure you're using a piece of paper and a pencil because this thing is no eraser except for my actual eraser. Now, draw two tiny little ears on the side. The lines up so you can express the inner ear. Now, draw two circles on the side of the face. Make sure they're small enough so you can fit in the nose and the mouth as well. And now put two half a circles inside of the eyes. This will make it look more kawaii, which is a Japanese word for super duper cute. Now I'll take a little nose and make a line right here. And then connect this with the nose. I'll wait for you guys to do that. Now we're gonna make a body make a circle and make an inner belly because most bears have like a tan belly or teddy bears. I'm gonna be drawing a teddy bear here. Now make some arms or claw or claws. And to indicate the claws, draw like three lines or three or two lines. To indicate some claws and we're gonna do the same for the feet. If you're using a piece of paper, you can color this when you're done. I'm just gonna sign my name, even though I am going to erase it. Make sure you sign yours. You can always color it as well. And let's get to our next drawing. And while you guys are getting another piece of paper, I want to talk to you about my inspiration, Doodle Dude. He's an incredible man. He's on live one o'clock every day of the week that it's a school day on Facebook. Make sure you go check him out. Use like your mom or dad's phone or something like that. All right, now let's draw Venus. This is one of my favorite characters to draw. All right, make a little C in the middle of your paper. And this is what I like to call a crescent moon. Make a point and then make it look like that. And point out. Now let's make two eyes. So make one big eyeball up there and another one right there. Put some eyeballs in there. Doesn't really work with this thing. I switch my marker real quick because this thing's getting dried up. That's a bit better. Yeah, definitely better. Now make a little tongue. And now let's make a little flower pot. So make a little rectangle down here. Hope I'm not going too fast for you. And now make a little plant pot here. So here's my favorite part, the expression. All right, the sound effects make it look better. No, 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 and make two lines going out on each hand. Line up in the middle. These are going to be like tridents, you know, the ones like King Neptune uses. So now put two lines out on each side. And it'll look like it has really sharp arms. Now let's do the same for the legs. I'm going to have to kneel down up there for a second. Again, Doodle Dude, live Monday through Friday, 1 o'clock on Facebook. Loves doodling. He's great. He'll teach you a lot of what I know. Go check him out. Let me just draw this. It might get a bit crowded, but don't worry. That just will make it look cooler. And there's my drawing. Sign your name. Make sure you use your signature. That's not your signature. That is my signature. I hope you all enjoyed today's doodling lesson. And peace.